Hey you guys. Um I just wanna make a quick video <laughs> and just show you guys uh like uh, some stuff that I've been using. Like some of the stuff like it's not even like a lot of stuff, it's just um things that I have added. I have like a super huge list. For things to buy okay well first let me just start off with this i did pick winners for the shea moisture contest and i did send those winners um email to get shea moisture sent out to them whatever or i sent them a, a youtube message so i did pick that but i enjoyed them um the contest so much that in november um, for you know Thanksgiving because I usually buy too much stuff for a day after Thanksgiving anyway But I'm buying a lot of products and I want to do another giveaway because it was so fun this time I think I'm gonna do a giveaway um, Of things that I really enjoy so it'll probably be about five or so products So stay tuned for that. I really do love the giveaways though Because it gives like and I just like gave one of my best friends um like a lot of the stuff that I didn't use like I had like quick curls and what did I have I had quick curls and like curly pudding I absolutely did not use them so I gave them to her um but not just that like a whole bunch of like conditioners and stuff because I'm trying to steer away from silicone and it's like stuff that I like, haven't even like you know how I like I show you guys the hauls like I do that and then I don't use this stuff retarded like in a waste of money anyway neither here nor there so I'm gonna actually just show you guys this stuff um like my hair this was actually a twist out that uh had to be um sprayed a little bit so there's some of my real curls and then there's a twist out in here but the twist actually came out really good and I'll use with shea butter for that. And I watched whose video? Strawberry no. Jesus. Oh no, you know who I watched? I watched um Well, I'm gonna pull it up and then I'll tell you guys at the end so I don't forget. But anyway, um I'm gonna show you guys really quick the products that um I've been using. So first and foremost grapeseed oil from Trader Jones grapeseed oil mixed with because I've been using this for like leave-in Trader Joe's nourish spa I know a lot of you guys use this conditioner um, but I love it like basically it's just like a natural conditioner so any natural conditioner even if you go to whole foods whole foods has a really good one i can't think of the name but basically the conditioners that are natural work super well and i basically made basically basically i um made a leave-in so like mostly like it's like three parts water and well t yeah it's like for a four ounce bottle it's three ounces of water an ounce of conditioner and then probably like I don't know maybe two tablespoons maybe two tablespoons of oil maybe and it works super super well like I love that you can like you know change up the the oil but pretty much like when you do a leave-in you want it to be like as liquidy as possible so that's why I chose to do three ounces of water in the ounce of that and it worked pretty it works really well like there's no white when it comes out it's white in the bottle but it's not white when it comes out um, and it works really 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 well um, I really enjoy that um, I'm in the reason why I originally made that leave-in in the first place was because I needed a leave-in because I bought curl formers yay I think they're somewhere around here. I brought the big box or the salon box because I'm trying to, I'm going to try to elongate my hair. Something like this. So I know curl formers are a great idea. I know some people like what I'm going to try to do is what Curly Nikki does. Uh, oh, and by the way, the, the, <clears throat> excuse me, the one who I watched her tutorial on the braid out. 
was Kinky Curly Queen. So I use um, Natural. Like I, I love her. Her name is Whitney too. But anyway, um, Natural. Um, she has really good like twist outs and stuff like that. Um, Kinky Curly Queen, like she did a braid out um, using like oil. It was argan oil and hemp seed butter, I believe. And so you watched her video for that. Um, those are pretty much the two people that I watched if I want to do like a twist out or a braid out, which I don't do that often. But this came out super nice that I'm probably going to do it, you know, more often. For the winter, I'm trying to like only, only, when I say wash, uh, only wash my hair once a week. And by wash, I mean water and conditioner or shampoo or whatever. Um, because it is getting colder and I don't want to have my hair, you know, washed as much. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to like, you know, make it a little bit better. So, but yeah, those are the two things. Okay. And then I want to tell you guys that I'm such a liar. So I told you guys that I hate this because it dries your hair. And if you look up We Dad, this is the climate control gel. But if you look up We Dad and you look up the gel, every, like, not everybody, but a lot of people will say they hate this gel because it dries their hair out and then they have to do like a protein treatment or something, whatever, to get it to go back. You know what? I hated it too. But it's almost gone. Oh, you guys can't see because it's not, it's like right here. And I found out a better way to use this. So this gel is awesome when you are putting a little gel on so like for instance so like I said like when, when I do my um, co-washes and then I put conditioner on my hair and that's what I'm using um, if it's gonna be like rainy or like it's hot or period like if I want a little bit more hold a little bit more curl definition what I do is I put this on top so like I want to say like maybe like a little bit more than the size of a quarter that's it for the whole hair and what I do is I put it in my hair my hands and I rub it together and I go like this to the ends first then I go like this to the to the top and then I rub it all the way through like that and that's it so on my hair today um, because like really there was like almost like no curl left um, and that's my fault because of the way that I slept on it um, from the braid out. So what I did was I sprayed this, not even a lot, it wasn't even like super wet. I sprayed it to get it damp. I put about, I don't know, like maybe, yeah, maybe, maybe like a quarter size of, shampoo, of conditioner in my hands, rub it together, put it through my hair, and then I put a quarter size of this. And then I put it through here. And this is what I got. Um, yeah. I wasn't looking for, like, you know, lots of definition. But at the same time, I had, like, no curl. And this is how what I got from that, from a little bit of water, the conditioner, and that. And that's generally what I get when I do, when I do this, you know, setup. So I really like that, like, a lot. So I will be repurchasing We Dad, and I was thinking about purchasing the curls line over again. I tried the curls from Target. It, my hair looked really nice. This was like about almost a year ago. My hair looked really nice, but I didn't like the way that it felt. Considering that it was a year ago, and my hair is probably probably this short, um, because my hair has been cut twice since then. Um, but considering that my hair was shorter, um, because this was only a couple months after a big, my big chop, I'm very sure that it might be a little different. So I'm thinking about purchasing the regular line, um, not the target line. I'm not sure. I'm actually going to do some research to figure out what are the main differences between those two things. But I just want to give you guys an update on those three products. Um, love the grapeseed oil, love the Trader Joe's conditioner, and actually like Weed Act because it's been working well and my hair doesn't feel dry at all. So, alright you guys, just trying to make this short, but it wasn't, but my bad. So you guys have a great day.